I did call my mom and ask her if she'd be mad at me if I dropped out of college. She literally wasn't even mad at me and I was so surprised. She was telling me that nothing she learned in college even helped her with her job now, but like you just needed to get the degree and I think that's why she wasn't pissed at me for saying all this stuff. I was and I am genuinely considering it. But yeah, she wasn't mad at me. She was kind of like understanding about it, but at the same time, she was like, you know, just get a degree. Like, <laughs> make sure you graduate with a degree. I'm going insane, I think. I'm just going crazy. This week has been really tough, really, really tough in like all areas of my life. And on top of that, the school workload has been just outstanding. It's been very difficult to manage anything else with the amount of schoolwork I've had. I'm not a huge fan of college at the moment. And honestly, it's it's really just the academic-based stuff that makes me want to drop out, I swear. I think about college and I think about it from a business standpoint and how college is designed so you go to school for four years and you take all these random classes to get your degree when you don't really need like half of those classes. I'm a CS major and I'm taking biology like biology and biology lab. Like why do I need biology if I'm going to CS? And I was thinking like, what if I dropped out and I got a private CS tutor and I just learned CS, or like I went to a boot camp and I learned and then I'd be fine. Like, why do I need to go to college? I'm just having a crisis, I think. I'm just going kind of like spinning, I'm spinning. Yeah, I have this huge coding project due next week that I am like halfway through and I, my left eye is actually twitching again. It stopped twitching for a while and now it's just back. So <laughs> that's really exciting. I think it's definitely stress induced. So, and I'm taking all these classes I don't need and my GPA is dropping because I have to focus on CS, but I also have to focus on biology and calculus when I feel like calculus honestly isn't even that important for CS. So yeah, maybe I'm being dramatic. Maybe I just need to calm down, but, but I'm not kidding when I say that dropping out is an option. It literally is. Like, I feel like this is so out of character for me to say because I'm someone that's pretty studious, so. I was telling a few friends about this and one of them was talking about how college is one of the biggest connection building places to be. And I agree, I think that is completely true, but with COVID, it's really hard. But what's also annoying is that we're paying full college tuition for like online Zoom calls. We're not even in person doing hands-on things, which, I don't know, I just think it's like such a scam. Maybe I've been staring at code for too long. Maybe I've been studying for Calc for too long. The only class I really love is English. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I, I alternate so much between good and bad weeks. One week I'm super happy and one week I'm like super depressed. This is a depressing week and it has been cloudy for like three days now and it's gonna be cloudy for like another week and a half. So that's really helping my mood, clearly. The one thing I will say helps though during this time is to write, like to actually journal and write about like how I'm feeling. I feel like that like really helps. That's something I've done forever. And that leads me into the sponsor for today's video. This video is sponsored by Lita. Lita is a website and app that has so many different features and one of them is journal entries that you can share with your close friends and family. You can have different little groups where you can write little stories and send them to each other or keep them private. It's totally up to you. I think it's a really cool way to keep in touch with people you don't see all the time or maybe live far away from you and you don't always get to talk to. But stories are just one feature that Lita has. There are so many different things that you can do on this app. The release date is still tentative and I will keep you guys updated on that, but it will be soon, which is really exciting and I can't wait to use it and tell my friends to use it and share little stories about my friends about college and things like this that are on my mind. I really do go insane when I don't get an outlet to like talk and write and stuff like that. But yes, check it out when it's up. I will keep you guys updated. But yeah, this was me having a mental breakdown camera. I hope you enjoyed. <laughs> Nothing is going well right now. That's okay. Hopefully things will turn around soon. They usually do. I'm betting on that very heavily. I'm sorry, my videos have been kind of whack lately. I don't sleep anymore. That is the life of a comp side major, so. Anyway guys, I'm gonna go. <laughs> um, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed, that helps out a lot. Subscribe if you want, I upload videos every Saturday. Anyway guys, I'm gonna go, so I will see you next week with another video. So until then, bye.